what's going on folks welcome back to another scum video i hope we're doing well ladies and gents in this video i'm going to be checking out every use you can use with the emps and what they do and what they don't do this is quite interesting uh, there's a couple of things here i didn't even know myself so we're going to have a little look see it's a very short video smash like hit subscribe all that gucci stuff and i'll catch you friday thank you Right, so for this one, ladies and gents, we've got the wardrobe, which we're going to be using a BCU lock, so you can use an EMP to get through one of these. Now, it's a little bit more difficult because you only have seconds to play with, and you also have a lock. Um, obviously, it's optional to have a lock. Now, these BCUs uh, locks here at the top, you can see the top left, you can put a battery in there. Obviously, that's how you're going to have to power it, and then you can temporarily, uh, t temporarily take it down with the BCU. So if you chuck it in there, Mini, um, chuck the battery and then chuck it in the wardrobe, you guys will see. If you look on the wardrobe itself here, She's now added a lock, and now she's going to add the BCU lock, which is going to give you another, um, which is going to light up another logo here, which you can see the BCU lock there. So um, I'm going to spawn in a EMP, um, and obviously we are on test server for the purposes of this, ladies and gents, to show you this. This is mainly for new players as well. So I'm going to throw in EMP. Now you're going to hear an audio. It's just it's now disabled. Um, it's now disabled the wardrobe, and I've got seconds to get in. If I don't unlock this, there you go. That's it. It's already done. That's how fast it goes. So if you can't get in there, and I'm not going to re-record this for the purpose of that, but if you can't get in there in that time period, then you are not going to be able to get in. You can throw multiple EMPs. It depends how much you want to get into that wardrobe. But you can see how good that BCU lock is. So it's only a matter of seconds. Um, before you do that the next portion of this video um, is going to be on the zappers okay so for this one ladies and gents we have the door so we've got some zappers on here and we've got some locks as well so matrix put this on here so just to see me get shocked so let's put the ui on you can see the bottom left hand corner i'm at 78 percent health so if you see here i've failed and now i'm at 71 percent health so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to throw an emp grenade And now what I'm going to do is we're literally just looking at the health. So 71% health still. So you can see now those those zappers, the lock protection, the zappers there, are actually not doing anything. So you can see I'm purposely just... There you go. And now it's doing damage again. So you can see the amount of time you get. So you don't get long. So look, we throw another one. There you go. So now you can see that I've now got time to do this. And you can even hear... You can even hear that sound... There you go. I didn't mean to actually do that. I wanted to keep the lock on. Um, but you can see now, we can now open the door. And there we go. So, the EMP does uh, does a great job there. Thanks, Mini. So, for this one, ladies and gents, we're looking at the vehicles. Now, you can disable these vehicles with the EMPs, which will completely disable the battery 100%, make it dead. Perfect for those ambushes, but you have to be very accurate in where you're actually throwing these. Okay. And there you go. As you can see, the vehicle is completely disabled now. And the battery is dead. Let's have a look at the battery now. Let's open up the, uh, the hood here. Let's open up the bonnet. And let's take out the battery. And you guys can see zero out of 100 right now. Now, she does have some batteries inside her vehicle. Let's take a look at those. So the, vehicle, the batteries that are inside the vehicle are safe. So obviously in the inventory are safe. And I guess that's because it's a game, ladies and gents. It gives you that opportunity to be able to put a new battery in a car if you get ambushed and you make it out alive. Um, so that's basically the EMP with the vehicles um, as well. For anyone who's asking about the aircraft, check this out. Right. So for this one, ladies and gents, we're looking at the aeroplane. And yes, you are going to see an aeroplane on fire up the hill right there. I'll zoom in on it right now for you. We're going to show that blooper at the end of this video because it's quite amusing. And um, so we're going to look at the aircraft now. So you can throw an EMP at the aircraft. Feel free, mean streak. And it will manipulate the aircraft as well. So once an EMP is thrown towards it, what you're going to see is you're going to see the throttle and my controls are now manipulated. So I can't turn, I can't do anything. There's no throttle, I'm max throttle right there. And you're gonna see once this wears off, now you can see, obviously I can now, you know, and there you go, and it happens again, which is really cool. Man, this is really good. Look at the graphics on that, that's really nice. Really, really cool. So yes, EMPs do affect aircraft, ladies and gents, and there we go. Ladies and gents, we're on MVGs now, so. Now this 
is also affected by the EMP. So maybe if you want to throw a grenade over here. So if you are in the woods and you know someone's using NVGs, you can knock them out. And this is basically what's going to happen. It knocks out your NVGs temporarily. It doesn't completely disable your battery. So in some circumstances with NVGs, uh, uh, with um, EMP grenades, it will actually disable, not completely destroy the battery. Whereas the car, it will destroy it. Uh, with the MVGs, for example, if I take out my batteries here now, you can see it still says 10 out of 10. So if I insert that, I can still turn that back on. As you can see there, it just temporarily disables it in some way. Whereas with a vehicle, it will actually take out the battery. Um, now, I think the last one here is going to be the mechs, ladies and gents. And the devs have actually changed this a little bit. And we'll get into that in just a moment. All right. So for this one, for this one, guys, we're looking at the mechs. The, the devs have recently... Uh, change the time that the mechs are disabled by the EMP. So they've increased the time because it was like two or three seconds. It was ridiculous. So hopefully um, we're going to get a little bit of a longer time here. Mean Shriek's actually going to time it for us. And we're going to see how long they're down for. So we're going to throw these in right now. Ready? Start. Right, there we go. So she's timing it now. Also, this is very handy, guys. If you're not very confident like I wasn't today in uh, the D4 airbase, uh, up in uh, up north, so uh, you can use them to take them down. Stop. How many seconds? Fourteen seconds. Four. So you're looking at fifteen. I guess it's a fourteen, fifteen yeah, seconds I then. Guess, I guess it's fifteen. So you're looking at fifteen seconds, ladies and gents, um, on disabling these, which will give you a plenty of time. Now, obviously, up in D4 airbase, they are very tricky. Regardless if you're a pro or whatever, and you know the you know the routes of the mechs, it's very very tricky if you don't know, and it's a lot easier just to take EMPs. So, ladies and gents, that is the mechs, and I'm pretty sure that's it for the video. Now for the blooper of um, Mean Streak when we was uh, trying to record the part for the aircraft. You guys stay safe. Much love. Look after yourselves. Don't forget to hit that subscribe. Leave a comment down below as well if you did learn something from this. Take care. <laughs> yeah, but how do you change your speed of running? Shift. Oh, really? Yeah. So how do you increment your runs? Oh, oh there, you there we go. It was actually... W shift. <laughs> oh, okay. Right, so if you go up the hill a bit more. Oh, right, shit. slow down, slow down, slow down. No! <laughs> How do I stop? <laughs> I'm throwing the EMP. Oh. Did it work? No. Oh, but you know what? This this one doesn't have a battery. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just die? Yes. That was, that was my first ever plane ride. <laughs> oh my god, that was absolutely legendary. <laughs>